Hello and welcome to the pub team pep. This is a brand new series here on the channel. We are going to be taking a team from the eighth tier, I think, from uh, English football, plugging in some Guardiola-esque football and seeing how we go. All right, Guardiola-esque football might be a bit of a stretch, but we're going to base the tactics off of some Guardiola stuff and uh, see how we get on, basically. Um, firstly, uh, obviously, shout out to, obviously, Sorted Out SI if you're not on it. Or if you haven't checked it out, check out Sorted Out SI. They are brilliant. So much great stuff on that website, uh, including this database that this save is from. I think it's like the most popular one on the website. So um, if you know about it, you're like, if you know Sorted Out SI, you know about it. Anyway, um, anyway um, look, firstly, we've got to introduce you to the team. And um, as a fan of Taskmaster, the show, um, obviously hosted by you know Greg Davies and Alex Horn. Um, it was it was really easy when I saw just the other day um, the the new kits released by this team and um, this is who we're going with. We are going to be managing Chesham United. They are in the Southern League Premier South. They were uh, founded in 1917. Generals is their nickname. Best ever uh, accomplishment or highest they've ever flown in the, the tiers of the English football pyramid. Is probably the third round of the FA Cup, so I mean that's something to aspire to, and it's something that we can hopefully achieve in our first few seasons at least. Um, our stadium is the Meadow, capacity of five thousand, but only I think it's like two hundred and forty something are uh, seated. Um, and uh, for the um, those obviously who may not have seen it, um, I'll put the um, the kits up in the screen here so you can see just what I'm talking about with the. Um, the Taskmaster relationship and um, the lovely Alex Horn here. Obviously, a huge inspiration as to why I've chosen them. Um, it's an idea I've had for a little while that I wanted to do this sort of a save. And um, what better time than just as this kit's been released? And you know, I've just had a highly anticipated week off of recording videos and releasing videos and things like that. So why not get absolutely cracking? Get right into it. Um. So the next thing to talk about. Okay, firstly is our manager. Our manager is, um, if you look at his attributes, he's absolutely cracking. Um, his name is Joe Guardian. He is from Chesham. His favorite team is Chesham. Um, I tried to basically, if you look at his stats here, which aren't uh, fabulous, um, I tried to basically take Guardiola in the game, like as closely as I could, you know, mimic his st stats and take it down to the the level which is a national b license is what he's got and um, so you know work to be done and um we'll be obviously applying for hoping that our um you know board are willing to send us to um get our national a and the continental and all that sort of stuff um anyway that's the man for the job joe guardian obviously named after joseph josep pep guardiola joe guardian he's our man He's the man for the job. Let's have a look at the tactics. So this is what we'd love to be playing. Look, at, at some point, we'll be playing something similar to this, um, hopefully getting, you know, up to the, the upper echelons of Premier League, Champions League glory, that sort of stuff, playing, you know, this, um, you know, much talked about um, sort of 3-2-4-1 um, formation that's been, you know, it's really been in the media a lot and on Twitter spaces and things like that uh, in the last, you know, season or so especially given um you know manchester city's success in the season just gone the player roles obviously i've just sort of uh put them in how i see them fitting sort of and then it's not how we're going to play we're not going to be able to play that there is absolutely no way in the southern league premier south we're going to be able to play that um so i've sort of modified it so it's similar it's very similar to the 3-2-4-1, but it's it's sort of a 3-2-2-2-1, two, 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 or a 3-2-2-3 three, two, two, three is what they're calling it on here. Um, I've also gone to cautious, so we're basically playing counter-attacking football, because I'm i not going to sit here and try and say that these players are going to be brilliant, that they're going to be able to be, you know, tactically astute or tactically diverse or versatile is maybe what I was going for, not diverse. Um, or, you know, they're going to play beautiful tic tac one-touch, two-touch football. They're going to lump it forward, and we're going to hope that we've got strikers that can do something with it. Um, and hopefully, with this formation, we get enough goals. And, and again, hopefully, we have enough defensively to cover it. That's the plan, anyway. Um, 
going to be rough. If you're looking at finances, um, you know, we don't have a lot going on. We've got 23,000 in the bank. Um, this season, somehow, we've made a profit of 10 grand already. Our wage budget is 3,819. We're already spending 3,700 of that without a complete school, uh, staff. Um, you can see it says, it says three coaches, but I'm sure, okay, what I've done is I, I haven't pressed like continue once at all. I've gone ahead and fired the ones that are, you know, we've got too many. So I've fired, um, I th think the fitness coach because my fitness coaching was actually better than his um, somehow. Fire the technical call, technical director, excuse me. Um, fire the recruitment analyst, loan manager, sports scientist. They're all gone. Um, now we've got to, you know, I don't know, just hope that we can, you know, do some stuff with this squad. This is what they look like. This is what the ability and potential look like. I mean, and that's not necessarily going to be accurate. You may be able to hear my dog in the background shaking and being annoying. Um, Jake Peck is the pick of the bunch. Um, he is sensational. Look at the guy. 22 years old, smashing haircut, um, and he'll be playing probably the midfield on attack. No, he's terrible at attacking. He'll probably be playing one of the defensive roles because that's probably what he's best at. Um, worth three to seven thousand, absolute huge amount. Um, then we've got uh, Ricardo German. Um, he's just signed for the club. This is the first season here. He's going to play probably mostly as the striker, maybe even a bit on the wing because. Um, he can do a bit of both, and we've got plenty of strikers, so see what he does. And then Frankie Sutherland, this is the fellow who play in the attacking role, because he is really an attacking midfielder. He is an under-21 international some time ago, um, and uh, looking at his, at his stats, he is quite good for this level. So if, if we could somehow get 35,000 for it, he's on 700 a week. What's his, what are the contracts like? He He's on the most, then Clayton, who's not very good. Shouldn't be. Can I get rid of him? I want to keep Sutherland, get rid of Clayton. Um, goodness, everyone's contract expires next season, ex apart from Billy Summers, who is a auto-generated goalkeeper who'll be our backup, and uh, he's unambitious. Everyone, if you look at... Uh, okay, I'll do it this way, right? If we <laughs> go to mentoring and go add group, uh, yep. If you go add player, everyone's balanced. I'm not sure... If that's just a, like an oversight or or something in the um, creation of the database or whatever it is, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but everyone's balanced, which is very odd. And then there's the unambitious Billy Summers, which is probably why he's at Chesham United for now. Anyway, um, we are going to get cracking. I'm going to go through preseason. You won't have to deal with any of that. I'm going to bring you back for the first uh, game of the season and um, look. We'll see how we get on with our. Pep, our pub team pep tactics. See you shortly. Preseason has been and gone. It was sensational. I had a fantastic time. I hope you did too in the, you know, milliseconds you were gone. We've made one signing. He's in the starting lineup. He's so good they've named him twice. It's Joseph Joseph. Ah, uh, fantastic. Just fantastic now. Um, also, he's 20 years old. Um, he, he's... Our coach really loves him. Um, he looks decent. Um, we definitely are lacking depth, as you can see. Um, like a more attacking midfielder is playing in the advanced roles. Maybe Jay Edwards should go back there. He's yeah, he's probably more defensive. All right, let's swap him. That'll it'll do, honestly. Um, and you know we have too many people for the bench, but um, it is what it is, and that's just what we're going to have to go with. Um, Preseason was up and down, but we did first teams that were better than us, teams that were uh, much worse than us, and all that. Um, anyway, let's uh, let's just get to it. I want to see playing out of position. I don't care, Jordan Edwards. You can absolutely suck it. Um, let's just get to the game. Um, get get to the game. Um, anyone exciting in their name in their thing? Um, Lewis Hall, but it's probably not the Chelsea one. Um, that's about it. Um, all right, let's. Oh. Let's, oh, we're not even at home. Reversing the mighty Swindon S Supermarine. I went to say Submarine. Um, the, yeah, that one. Oh, man, I don't know how this is going to go, honestly. We are predicted to come seventh in the, um, oh, enjoy your hundredth appearance, Bradley. Legend. Club legend. Here is their lineup. The absolute stunning. There's Lewis Hall. Looks just like him. Um, 
Yeah, we're, sorry. In the season preview, we're predicted to come seventh. Um, don't know how that's going to change, given that we... There are like three fans. How good is that? Um, how that's changed, given like the tactics and the... Now we've got Joseph Joseph in there. He's so good they named him twice. He's got it. We've got to sit, surely be on it. Um, all right. It's, I've got to change this because uh, it's just kind of shit me. Um, all right. Underway. Let's uh, get it going. Let's see what we can do. Um, I definitely, like I had a different save, not with this team um, down at this level, just to try out tactics and things. Um, uh, like... <laughs> I did just try to go all out, like pet ball. Um, didn't go well. Um, it was a team, I can't remember, it was some other division, but we were predicted to come like fourth and we were down in the relegation. Clayton header, oh, almost good start though. I'm into that. Hopefully playing this brand of football, we just, I don't know, get the ball forward quicker and hope for the best, basically. Um, I'm also going to hit it with a pause there. Let's let's see, let's watch our pass map. because I mean, we're not exactly playing you know, Pep, uh, Pep-esque football, but, you know, maybe we'll start to resemble some shape. It's not there yet, but it might get there. Let's, let's, let's hope. Let's hope. Um, all right, 30, this has been a nothing first half. What's happened? 42 minutes in, nothing's happened. 50-50 possession, two shots each, couple of yellow cards right at the death. Lovely. Absolutely lovely stuff. Um, Look, um, yeah, I'm proud. Ooh, that was like a shot of lightning. Um, all right. Look, I've never done a save like this. Like, I've never, obviously on YouTube, um, I've only ever done, what have I done? Um, I did a Manchester United one on the Xbox. Um, I did the Sevilla one and then the, the other one, whatever it is. <gasps> Clayton. Oh, good chance. That's our best chance of the game, surely. Um, should have been doing better with that, probably. Oh no, Joseph, Joseph is injured. Um, all right, well, he's not injured, he's just wrecked. And a terrible corner, good. Good, 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 love that. Let's, oh, and let's just hope we can do something, honestly. I would just absolutely froth getting three points to start off the season. We'll encourage them again. Somehow we've had the possession, I don't really understand it. Besant, Besant with the uh, long goal kick, headed down by Doofus, I don't know what that said. Headed away by someone. Peck doesn't win it. Do it actually is Doofus. I feel like that's. I feel like that's not the first time I've seen the name Doofus as a footballer. Big ball over the top. Oh, for Massey. Oh, Beeson, you absolute beast. That was sensational. What a save. What a goalkeeper. Um. Oh, I wonder what's on the menu at the hot dog thing. Um. Clayton's done. Bugger all. He's having a nightmare. Beeson, blood. Oh, sensational goalkeeping. All right, we will, at this juncture, make a couple of subs. Let's bring on Bradley for, for Ferdinand. Um, we'll actually just make that one. And then, you know, we've got options here with Prosper and Gibbons. And um, go from there. See how we get on. 25 minutes to go. Corner for them. Swung in, headed away-ish. Sutherland then clears. You can see we've got everybody back, and that's intentional. Because um, I don't want to concede lots from corners. And I don't want to concede lots of possession when we have corners. So here's a hole to edge. Great name. Swings it out wide to McDonough. In for Massey. Off the bar. Oh, cleared by Edwards. My goodness. We need to switch on. Something's not quite clicking. Um, let's bring on a... What's happened? Sub. Um, Yikers. All right. Let's go with Sutherland for Prosper and just... Hope for the best, um, even though we're taking off probably our best player, and we have done that twice now with, um, who was it? Oh, Joseph Joseph came off, that's right. Um, you know, not a sensational start, but uh, obviously with this tactic, we are going to evolve it. We are going to, you know, play by, play by year and see how we get on, and, you know, games like this will be like, well, we were okay. We did have more XG than them, despite having much less shots. So really, we possibly could have won it at the end of it. Clean sheets are clean sheet though, and clean sheets I feel like with this setup are going to be rare. So I'm pretty happy with that. Nil draw, not too much to write home about, but I'll take that. So then, not an electric start, but I feel like we've got a long road. So there's a lot of excitements to come. Uh, I hope. 
at least we don't have Merthyr Town's badge, because that would... Look, we've got... Ours is fairly, you know, standard, and it is what it is, but at least we don't have whatever whatever's happening here. Also, like, this does not look good. We'll hope to address that. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. Make sure you do leave us a like. Subscribe if you're new around here. Comment what you think of the video. Think of the series. Give me any tips. Um, as I said, very new to doing um, this sort of low-level, um, you know, what is it? Road to Glory sort of thing. Um, or Park to Prem or Non-League to Legend. You know, that sort of thing. Um, so, you know, I'd, I'd take any hints, tips, um, tweaks to the tactics, anything like that. Let me know what you reckon. And um, that Lewis, until next time, peace.